Hello, my name is Louise Barry. Um, I'm a clinical nurse researcher. Um, I'm a doctoral student in the nursing and midwifery department here in UL, and I also teach within the nursing and midwifery department. I'm here today to introduce um, one of our nursing students, our undergraduate nursing students, who's going to talk about some research that she was involved in and her experience with the undergraduate nursing programmes here in UL. Her experience was really positive, so it'll give you a little bit of a snapshot into doing nursing here in UL and hopefully will induce you to come and do nursing here in UL. To start off, I want to give you a little bit of context though. It is so vitally important that nurses are involved in research. Uh, this is because of our unique person-centred approach to the way in which we care for patients and then that is reflected in the research that we carry out. It is completely focused on practice and completely focused on the individual. So nationally and internationally nurses are contributing by reviewing the evidence that informs our practice through reviews, major reviews, to ensure that it's credible and reliable and that our practice is informed by the best evidence possible and then um, being involved in all forms of primary research. Nationally, we are contributing to the development of documentation that can inform the care of older adults. Internationally, we liaise with specialists, nursing specialists abroad. And from a local perspective, from a local level, we have collaborated with our colleagues, so nursing colleagues, in University Hospital Limerick, pertaining to renal research, which Tara will discuss later, and formed the Midwestern Renal Research Group to inform the care of patients who are transitioning from acute renal disease or chronic renal disease to renal replacement therapy. This evidence then informed the way in which they care for this patient group and had a significant impact. So in terms of nursing research, it informs the curriculum here in UL, informs the programmes that can then induce practice changes and really um, ensure that we provide the best quality care possible. So I'm now going to hand you over to Tara, who is going to discuss her experience here in UL, and I hope you've learned a little bit from this. My name is Tara Kennedy, I'm studying general nursing and I'm in my third year in UL. This is my second career and the reason I went back to do nursing was because I initially did a first aid course and I kind of liked it, so I applied to UL for nursing. For me it was now or never and it was UL or nowhere else. Uh, the location for me is an absolute bonus. I love the programme that I'm studying at the moment uh, for many reasons. One being is we get to work, have our placements in the local hospital. So for me, it's UHL and also in Nina. So this means I get to work with people and in an area which I hope to work in in the future. And I'm also building relationships with people who, again, I'll be working with in the future, hopefully, and who will guide me and help me in my first job as I find my feet in nursing. The programme is great in that we get a balance of practical work and also theory. So we get to experience a lot of clinical work in the labs, which is a bonus to us when we're out in the clinical field. But there's nothing like experience in first hand. The clinical placements are great for a learning experience. And all you want to do is help as much as you can and learn as much as you can. And the placements are definitely the area to do that. There's also a huge variety of placements. So you can do anything from theatre, uh, to uh, mental health, to intellectual disabilities, to midwifery, to community and public health, to ICU. It's just so varied and you learn so many skills and there's so many different personalities that you get to meet along the way as well. And like I said, all you want to do is learn. So the advantages of going to UL for me is, of course, uh, the location. It's so easily accessible for me. And the campus here in UL is just absolutely stunning. There's so many facilities that we can use. I've been able to use the gym, the fabulous new library, but also the clinical skills labs and of course the cafes for the numerous cups of coffee that you're going to need to get along the programme. The opportunities I have received while on this programme have been massive as well. I've been honoured to have been asked to help with a research project last summer and we looked at patients on the renal uh, programme, so going to the renal clinic and their experience of that going from that onto dialysis. So I assisted on that and I had various roles in it. I sat in on some interviews, I transcribed some interviews, I also did the coding within Vivo for that research. And the experience was just incredible. I learned so much. One of the biggest le lessons I learned was communication. It is paramount in our role as nurses. If someone had said to me last year, what do you think of research? I would have said, don't like it, don't even understand it. But having come through the process and had the experience that I've had, it's so important to our role as nurses. And I really think we can't progress in our career as nurses unless we carry out research. 
And thank you so much for listening to Tara and I. And if you want to learn a little bit more about anything we've discussed today, you can contact the Nursing and Midwifery Department here at the University of Limerick or contact myself, Louise Barry, at louise.a.barry at ul.ie. Thank you.